reflecting listening and ownership of the inquiry. In many contact centers, agents are encouraged to use reflective listening. This is where the agent repeats sentences or important details back to the customer, saying, okay, just to recap. This reassures them that you are paying attention. While mirroring these words, it is also important to mirror the customer's tone. Sometimes it's about stopping and just moving on, thinking about how to match and mirror the customer's mood and use similar words, phrases, and tone. So listen out for the words and phrases that are being used. And if the customer has the same accent as the agent, they should play to that. The only time you don't do that is when the customer is aggressive. But if the customer is really bubbly and enthusiastic about a holiday that they are going on or a wedding that they are going to attend, then the enthusiasm should be mirrored. Equally, if the accent is not the same, make sure colloquial language is not used. Make their problem your problem. Remember, agents must take ownership of the inquiry, especially if it is a complaint. It is important to have a one-to-one -one relationship with your customer so that they have a point of contact that they can come back to. So when the customer voices their issue, it is important to acknowledge it and signal that their concern has been understood so the customer feels as though the problem has been lifted from them. Agents can use a statement such as, I realize that this situation is difficult, but let's try and find a solution to do this. Such a statement begins with a personal recognition using I, while also finishes with we to create a notion of teamwork, which can boost rapport.